So I decided that I'm going to clean this hen house out and get it cleaned out the rest of the way. I'm going to set my two, both waters up anyhow, or at least the bricks, because what I do is I take and use plastic waters. Well, I'll show you guys when I get it set up. There's bricks I put down, then there's heat plates I set on top of the bricks. And then that cord, actually that thing's been plugged in all year. Oops. <laughs> Oops, my bad. All right, so, so I got the bricks set up kind of how I want them. Oh uh, yeah, that'll be perfect. Can't be any more better than that. All right, so bricks go like that. I'll plug this thing in right quick and see if see if the thing gets hot. If it don't get hot, I'm gonna have to go and buy a. Ew, look at all the crap on that. That is not good. That's a that's a fire hazard waiting to happen, as my uncle would say. Um. So. Yeah, they're all clean. Plug it in, we'll see if it gets hot. So I got them, that plate there, I'll set up around the, I always run the cord around the back side of the post because that way it's not out here in the open. The chickens can, you know, poke at it and get electrocuted. Hmm. So for some goofy reason, that thing... Oh, could that be trip, maybe? Uh. Uh. Huh. <laughs> Lovely, there's no ground on that, but... Not gone. I don't know. So I tried, I got that one plugged in. To this one here, still the middle one, maybe the middle one went bad or something. Cause that one ain't getting hot for nothing. Neither is this one. Hmm. Well, poop. Take that out. We try this top one here. There's supposed to be a light on in these things that let you know that the things are working. And this one ain't working. Well, ain't that just a fine howdy duty? Huh. So I figured why I had the wheelbarrow out, I was gonna wheelbarrow me some straw over here. I know they'll, they'll scatter it around, but yeah, it is what it is. Um, but like I said, yeah, they'll scatter it around. Man, I really wish I knew what the heck that light was for up there. I think, man, I don't know if something got screwed up with the outlet or what happened. Yeah, so dad came over. He's like, oh, push the button. Tell me a thing he's pushing. <laughs> uh -huh. Oh, good grief. Yeah. That thing he's pushing worth a darn. Good grief. I need something with a little more force. <clears throat> nope. 
Then to finish this out up here, we can make three different pins out of this. Pin here, pin there, and a pin way down there. Oh, let's see that red gate. That is a, that's a Steinway gate because of the latch here. So that gate swings this way. There's another gate, it swings that way, making three pins. One, two, three. Steinway also makes headlocks. These are really, 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 really nice for catching cows and stuff like that. Haven't really used, used them in a while, but they are nice if you have to give a cow shot or something or do something like that. So, I'll catch you guys next time. Thanks for watching. All right, so I know you all are probably curious about what I've done to fix that outlet problem is uh, Dad and I ran cords. Yeah, we ran a cord. This is the splitter I was using to plug both of these in. Um, the heated plates are working just fine. Plugged it in, ran a cord back behind the post like I had. Electrician's got to get another box. Ran it through, there, it goes down and around. Up over top of the door, not to create a trip hazard. To that outlet where this light is plugged in here um, for natural light so that my birds keep laying. Because it is dark in here, okay? And when it gets dark, them things do not like to lay worth a you know what. So, yeah. It's only a temporary fix for right now. All right, so we got a new outlet in this thing. Uh, you can see over there, no more uh, no more light on for the GFCI uh, thingy. Plugged her back in and... And we're nice and warm on, on the hot plates. So, yeah, that's good.